Good morning, Money Bulldogs. This is your principal, Mr. Rubio, coming to you with your morning announcements on this magnificent Monday, September 28th. Today is a B day. And I hope you're having a really, I hope you had a good weekend now. I hope you're having a great morning. It's a nice, cool morning, uh, which is good uh, because it's been very hot. And yesterday was very hot. Today's announcements will be a lot shorter than normal because brum, students are back. And that's right. Well, we had students back last week, but we have students back, or everyone's back, or I guess all grades are back, not everyone. You know what I mean. Students are back. We're so glad to have you this morning. We're so excited to see you. Um, so let me get right to it. Please rise and join us for the Pledge of Allegiance in Spanish in honor of Hispanic Latino Heritage Month. Yo prometo lealtad a la bandera de los Estados Unidos de América y a la república que representa. Una nación bajo Dios, indivisible, con libertad y justicia para todos. And now for the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. Now please remain standing for a moment of silence. Thank you. You may be seated. We do have some birthdays today, or one birthday. Oh, no, I forgot to spell check, y'all, and something's wrong with my PowerPoint. Hold on. There you go. That's better. Okay. Cool. So let's fix this real quick. Well, one, happy birthday, uh, Mr. Jason Cossum. Um, his brother just graduated this past spring. Uh, and Jason's now an eighth grader. Happy birthday to you, Jason. And Mr. Correa, our 11th grade pre-calculus teacher. Uh, happy birthday to you, sir. Uh, we hope you have a wonderful day. And we just want to note that it is Hispanic Heritage Month. And we hope that you are celebrating appropriately. And like I said, we'll, we won't do a spotlight today or uh, this day in education because uh, I want these announcements to be a little bit shorter than normal. Uh, National Suicide Prevention Month is this month. Um, God, what is wrong with this? Okay, I, I think I know what's wrong. Hold on. There we go. That's a little bit better, I guess. Um, uh, sure. National Suicide Prevention Month is this month. Um, as always, remember to reach out if you or someone you know is just needs support. Mental health is extremely important, and we need to make sure we're always prioritizing our mental health. Um, and there is a National Suicide Prevention uh, Lifeline if you should you need it. As we close out September, just a gentle reminder uh, of National Suicide Prevention Month. A meals update, uh, no real update there. You know the drill. You can get your workbooks here. Bus routes are here. We probably won't post these moving forward. Uh, maybe for a couple more days, but if you have any questions, call Miss Reed, like always. There is one page. There is the other page. Okay. Our schedule for 6th and 7th grade, this is a schedule for both in-person and virtual students. And then 8th grade, this is your schedule starting today. Virtual and in-person. Ninth grade, this is your schedule starting today. Virtual and in-person. Grades for quarter one. Uh, don't forget, your grades absolutely count this quarter. I mean, they count every quarter, but they definitely count this quarter, and they're due October 7th, so if I look at my calendar, October 7th is not too far away, that is exactly a week away, or sorry, a week and two days away, so on Wednesday, it'll be a week, um, so make sure you get your grades in, and if you're not attending school, then you, you're not going to get good grades, so that's step one, I always tell kids, especially in college, step one of doing well in college is just going to class, so make sure you're there, census also closes on September 30th, uh, if you haven't, if your parents haven't done it, ask them, um, it is in Spanish. They can call 211. They can go to atxcensus2020.com. Uh, there's a bunch of different ways. You can also go to any public library. Uh, just make sure you get it done. Okay. Community service opportunity is this uh, week. Uh, it's tomorrow. So if you haven't done this already, please do so. This will be the last day we are communicating this. ACT is next week on the 6th for 11th and 12th graders. Uh, we will have information on buses sometime this week soon if we are if we are running transportation i think we're going to try our absolute best to do so and then loteria night is this wednesday there's a lot going on in the next two weeks september 30th it's from six to seven in the morning i'm sorry six to seven p.m um you can sign up by emailing montopolis at gmail.com and hopefully you've brought these things uh, make sure you bring a clear mesh backpack make sure you write things to, bring things to write with things to write on your headphones a fully charged computer water bottle. Uh, you can bring your personal computer. We just can't mess with it too much uh, or at all. And then your uniform expectations are here. Please remember to bring your clear mesh backpack. That is a uh, requirement that has always been a requirement. And if you have questions, please text us at 512-814-5326. 
during normal school hours. You can also follow us on Facebook, uh, facebook.com backslash Montopolis College Prep. Uh, and remember that Bulldogs are determined, Bulldogs are optimistic, Bulldogs are generous, and Bulldogs are strong. And if no one tells you today, remember that we love you, believe in you, and always will. Have a magnificent Monday, Money Bulldogs. We're so excited to see some of you here in person again. Uh, everyone else, have a great day, and it's time for Move This World.